Welcome to the Three Minute Warning on VBN Sports. My name is David Rooney, and today I am joined by Liam McCormick of City Escape Adventures. How's it going, Liam? Good. Yourself? Fantastic. Thank you for joining us. Uh, you got your start in grassroots football right here in Chilliwack, uh, playing for the Chilliwack Giants. Uh, give us a little bit of background into your football journey. Uh, my football journey started kind of spontaneously, to be honest. I mean, I. I only started playing football because I missed the sign up for soccer one year. I know, I mean, I don't look like a soccer player, but I was at one point and um, yeah, so I, I missed that. I needed to join something and I ended up playing football and it just carried me all the way through life, all the way to this point, pretty much. And I understand you played it in, in uh, at least one provincial championship? Yeah, I played in multiple provincial championships. I won uh, two with my team, GW Graham. Oh, fantastic. I believe uh, you actually played against Chase Claypool in one of those uh, preliminary yes. games leading up to that. I actually played against Chase many times. Uh, we played we played together when he played community as well. Uh, we played against each other. We played against each other in high school. I mean, it was kind of the whole way up until we parted ways going into post-secondary. And I understand you did play football post-secondary with Waterloo? Yes, I did. Yep. Give, yeah. give, give us a little bit of background into what that journey was like. Uh, I played a year and a half there. It was uh, it was a great experience. I learned, I think, more there than I did in any other scenario because, you know, being on your own so far away from your family, I didn't have a support that I needed. I needed to just learn how to adapt, find people that could, you know, fill the positions that I needed and then move on from there and start focusing on getting the other stuff done that I was more confident with. Do you miss playing the game? Uh, yeah, sometimes, yeah. <laughs> Uh, let's let's uh, turn back to uh, your new business that you started uh, with your dad, and it's a family-run business here in Lower Mainland called City Escape Adventures. Give us a little bit of background into that. Uh, City Escape Adventures is a is a touring company. We do uh, four by four off-roading experiences. So if if people need to get to a specific spot, or they need to uh, be picked up or dropped off for a camping trip, and they don't have a vehicle, or they just want to come out with the newest and the greatest, then um, they can come out and find an experience with us to go pretty much anywhere in BC. Fantastic. What are some of the packages like? Uh, we got overnights. We're going to be soon setting up something probably for um, uh, engagements. We're going to be doing short day trips. Uh, like I said, pick up and drop offs. Pretty pretty much anything anything that involves a truck at this point. We're we're pretty much willing to do it. That's great. And I understand you do have a social aspect to it in that uh, you've now just recently made a donation to Chasing Hope, which is the BCCFA's mental health awareness program in partnership with Chasing Hope, tying in Chase Claypool again, um, kind of almost coming full circle for you. What's that like? Is that important to you uh, and your family's business to give back to the community? Uh, I think so. I mean, we've we've always found ways, not necessarily is money the best way always to give back we've always found ways to position ourselves in the community so that we can help and uh my dad has always been a coach he's always been on the football field with us and now just recently i'm going to be getting into coaching myself and i feel that's a good way to give back and you know pass on a lot of those lessons you learn to kids who are younger and who could use it earlier couldn't agree more. In fact, uh, I know you are going to be a coach for the BCCFA's The Game 2022 that's coming up on May 28th. Um, completely 100% volunteer run. Um, is it important to you to come back and volunteer your time as a coach for these kids? Um, I think it's something that's becoming more important to me. For, for a while, I was more focused on myself and what I needed to get done to move forward. But now I feel that it's something that I have the skills and the availability to do it. So I think that I should start giving back. I mean, the game gave so much to me, right? So 100%. And I understand that you, um, the Cityscape Adventures is also going to be a sponsor of the game and you will have a presence there, uh, whether it's a booth. I think you're probably going to have both your Jeeps there, things like that. Yep. Um, <clears throat> I personally will be on the sidelines coaching, but uh, yeah, my dad will be there with the Jeeps, I believe, yes. Wonderful. So if anybody would like to figure out more, uh, learn more information about Cityscape Adventures, you can go to Cityscape Adventures on Facebook and Instagram, as well as www.cityscapeadventures.com. Net. Uh, I know I look forward to being a customer and I can't wait to get out and uh, do one of your uh, fantastic excursions. Awesome. Thank you very much, Liam, for joining us. Thanks, Dave, for having me. This has been the 3-Minute Warning on BBN Sports. My name is David Rooney. Tune in next time for another great football guest.